Hi, my name is Miss Nancy, and I am an elementary school teacher here in Tampa, Florida, and the mother of three. And today, I'm going to show you how to make paper corsages. So the first thing you're going to need is tissue paper, lots of it. And you're also going to need a pipe cleaner. Now make sure your tissue paper is cut down to a small size. I'd say that's um, probably seven inches by seven inches, a nice square. And now what we're going to do is fold it like an accordion. I want you to fold it forward and then backward. Forward. It doesn't have to be more than an inch. As a matter of fact, try to keep it about an inch or less than an inch in width this way. Forward and backward. Forward and backward. Now paper corsages and paper flowers are my favorite to do with my own kids because they don't have to have scissors so I don't have to worry quite so much and they don't have to have glue, they don't have to have markers or paint, and it keeps my house clean for those times where the in-laws are coming over. So forward and backward, forward and backward, until we have one long strip. And I want you to take the strip, and in the middle, bend it, just like that. Now take your pipe cleaner and put it over, and pull it tight. One of the tricks here is to get this middle part about as small as you can, so pull it tight. And twist, twist, twist. What you're really effectively doing here is making a stem on the end of this. All right. And now, all we have to do is open up our flower like it's getting rain and sun to see the world. Of course, the smaller piece of paper you start off to begin with, the smaller flower you'll have in the end. And the larger piece of paper you start off to begin with, the larger flower you'll have in the end. So if you want to make a bunch of little tiny ones and put them together, it's truly beautiful to then put on a brooch or a pen, like a traditional corsage. Or you can do this, and then find one of your button loops, Put it through, and ladies and gentlemen, you have a paper corsage.